This is my SS Kresge All Pro. Just got this a few days ago. Uh, it was in pretty rough condition, so definitely rideable, but not comforting at all. Um, took it back to my house. All I did was really was regrease the bearings on the head tube and the crank, and it actually rides pretty fucking smooth. I ended up liking it more than I thought it would. I only bought it because I thought it looked cool. Um, definitely not the best bike in the world, but uh, I actually really like this a lot more than I thought it would. So I'm gonna end up keeping it longer than. I anticipated. Uh, this is actually my old rack. I put this on myself um, for one of my old projects. Um, I think it looks really good together. So, now I don't really want to do anything too dressed to this bike. I kind of want to keep it all original. Um, there's a few cosmetic things I just want to fix, like the fender is a little crooked. Um, of course, the tires need to be replaced. Um, I haven't decided yet if I want to polish up these rims. I mean, it's chrome underneath, so it should look alright, but I kind of like the way it looks like now. Nice little patina, if you will. Um, kind of disappointed this didn't come with the three speed Sturmy Archer. I uh, was thinking about getting that put it on here, but as of right now, I put zero money into this and it rides pretty nice, so I don't know if I want to change a thing about it. I might actually get one of those bullet lights for this front part. I think it'll look kind of nice. Um, I have... This is broken right here, so I have a uh, replacement for that, but it's actually a light that has a generator that hooks up to the tire, so whenever you pedal, it turns on. Uh, I think that'll work out really nice. It's kind of old looking too, so that'll match. I was going to replace the seat, but the seat's actually really nice too, um, surprisingly. It's better than my seat on my other bike that I paid pretty much the same price for this bike, so there's that. And then there's also some rust underneath this bottom fork. I don't know if you can see that right there, but uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and take some aluminum fault to that and dress that up nicely. But besides that, it's all good to go. These spokes need to be tight, um, tension of the course, and then trued, but. As of right now, I put zero dollars into this bike, and I'm quite happy about that, well besides the purchase cost.